now it's going to open up this grid and this is basically what my menu is going to look like but it's empty right now and like plexus 28 i want to add a bar on top just a set on top to, to go from shortcuts to my different categories of my menu so let's say i would have a shortcut here for home then main chorus dessert etc what i'm going to do is i'm going to start off by adding just a button color to make it easier to tell the difference between my shortcuts and my actual inventory items that I'm going to add later on. So button color, I select it on the top part of my screen and I just click on a square and I'll make it like blue and I'll do that for every single button on top. So that was my first page. What I'm going to do is I'm going to do that for every page that I actually have content. So on my second page I'm going to do the same thing. I'm going to add the colors. Now, in desserts, in home, I'm going to add the shortcuts on the top part of my screen. So, I'm going to select category panel add to edit, which is number two on top. And then I'm going to click on my first blue, blue square. And from there, I'm just going to add home anyways. And I'm also going to add desserts. So, I'm going to select desserts and click accept. For my desserts panel, I'm going to do the same thing. I'm going to add home and I'm going to have desserts. Now what I want to do is I want to add an item to my menu. So I'm just going to click on top. I'm going to select items, which is number one. And I'm going to click on an empty gray square. And then as you can see here, it brings up my inventory items, which I only have one. And it's cake. And I'm just going to select the cake and I'm going to accept it and as you can see it appears in my menu and I'll add it for desserts because that's the actual section I want to add it to but let's say it's a common selling item I'll add it to my home page then I'll exit that and I'm done setting up my touchscreen menu